Medicare care about getting you a job? Oh, no! no. Since the government privatized welfare through OCP two years ago, all that matters to them is their commission and profit that they get through our tax dollars. That's why they designed Provision 22 and ran it through the legislature. To keep us on welfare so that WebCare can turn our misfortune into cold, hard cash. We must continue to fight until Provision 22 is repealed. These people, they actually believe society owes them a life. You know, I push Provision 22 to stop slackers like them from cheating WebCare, but all they want is a free ride. It is annoying, isn't it? <laughs> Worse. If they manage to get Provision 22 repealed, we can kiss our profit margin goodbye. They're a threat to the entire system. If I could only put them all through my rehab program, help them to accept their station in life instead of complaining and making their lives miserable. It's a nice dream, but for the time being, we have to be selective, choose our targets carefully. Those two are the brains. With them gone, the entire movement will collapse. Do it, Martin. Do it, Flitch. The mod squad is standing by. Do it now. <laughs> you bet you, buddy. <laughs> It would be if you were a real cop, Martin, but you aren't. So back off, or I'll toss you and your mod squad in the can. Well, what about Father Marks? They're holding him prisoner. He's being held for questioning in connection with the terrorist attack on this facility. Provision 22 limits you to arresting web care clients who work illegally. I want you to release Marks now. Get a court order. We'll see what the limits on Provision 22 are. We can't do this. We had nothing to do with that explosion. I'll get into it with the DA, but for now, we'll have to question everyone. Let's get them into the port of purpose. Come on, Eddie, let's go. Move. This ball is an attempt to discredit us. The people of WebCare don't want you to know how they cheat and take advantage of those of us who are trying to get by on welfare. I don't know what I'd do without you, Alex. <laughs> They are on welfare. Looks that way. You're never around when we need you, Alex. Go ahead and shock the flat line, then let's quit. Okay, everybody clear! Officer Alex Murphy shot to death in the line of duty. Legally, he's dead. We can pretty much do what we want. There's a new guy in town. His name's Robocop. Murphy, it is you.
give us three minutes and we'll give you the world. This is Media Break with Bo Harlan and Rocky Crenshaw. Topping our news stories, icebergs wreak havoc on shipping in the Panama Canal. Russia's newly elected 345th parliament says niet to more military spending. And a Santa Monica terrorist group claims responsibility for shelling the Beverly Hills Wall. More after this. It's time for... Commander Cash! Anybody Cash, have a bags, civilians? I've got some spare change. Uh, Don't give the homeless your spare change. Give them a peace pie. Each peace wow. pie contains all the nutrition they need. Plus the miracle ingredient... Tranquil! That helps the homeless relax. They're happy homeless. Citizens, all that we're saying is... Yeah, give yeah, Peace yeah, Pies a chance. chance! It was a hot time in old Detroit today as a protest by WebCare clients angered by Provision 22, which makes it illegal to work while receiving benefits, literally exploded in violence. Community activist Father Gregory Marks was arrested for questioning by WebCare's Manpower Authority Utilization Department. But so far, no charges have been laid. Next. How do you protect your home from acid hail? An umbrella maker in Ohio thinks he has the answer. You think he'll be all right? Hey, two years ago, I saw Father Marks stand down a bulldozer to save the Nader Park project. He can take care of himself. What I don't get is how you ended up on welfare. What happened to Alex's pension? Trying to get it was a living nightmare. One stupid technicality after another. They kept turning me down and the bills kept piling up. Nancy could have come to me for help. I know. But one thing Alex's death has taught me is I have to stand on my own two feet. And you couldn't find work. You'd be surprised at how many decent jobs there are for single mothers with no work experience. I hit bottom. I was gonna lose the house. I needed money. Web care was my last resort. Don't touch that either. Can I make just one call? I'm a solo act, kid. Alpha 6, 211. Shots fired. 535, five, Deloria. Hi, are you a purple trader? A what? A criminal. I saw you and your mom come in on the port of perp. <laughs> no, we're not criminals. We're in welfare. Bummer. My name's Gadget. Jimmy. Do you work here or something? Not really. I just like to hang around and help me. Look, I gotta put up with my own kids at home. I don't need none getting in my way at work. Out, out. That's her favorite word. You wanna see something really cool? Sure. Out! It was your stuff. No. It was, it was in your pocket, right? Do you know how many sleep cycles you've missed? I have a job to do. Yeah, well, so do I. And you'd make my job a lot easier by sticking to the maintenance schedule. There, see? I told you. Ow. Hey, no kids allowed. Ow, let go. Let go. Robo and me are our pals. On account of because I'm a good citizen. Right? Right. Hi. You might not remember me. You're the greatest, Dad. Jimmy Murphy. Yeah, you got me out of a lot of trouble a few weeks ago, remember? Yes, I remember. Jimmy, I've been looking all over for you. What are you doing in here? I was just talking to Robocop, Mom. I don't know what I'd do without you, Alex. You're never around when we need you, Alex. Um, Gadget, I think I heard B say she could use some help. Okay. See ya, Jimmy. Sorry, B. Come on, mister. I gotta go out tonight and I'll be late, so you'll have to spend the night at the mission. Again? Yes, again. Let's go. They always made me come up with slogans for the protest signs. May I? Yeah, well, the synaptic laser's filthy. No wonder you're so touchy. 
I know what you're thinking, Murphy. Why is Nancy on welfare? It's probably just a screw up in the system. I'll look into it. No, I will. They are my family. The doctor will see you now. I don't care what you do to me. I'll never give in to you fascists. Treat him gently. He's a sick man. The DA just called. She wants Marks released within the hour. Not to worry. That should be plenty of time for Dr. Freelich to finish his rehabilitation. Good. Then we can concentrate on Mrs. Murphy. Get rid of these malcontents once and for all. Flitch? No. Division 22. Our intelligence, if that were can apply to Flitch, says Mrs. Murphy may be involved in illegal work activity. If we can catch her red-handed, not even the DA can keep us from taking her in. Then rehab. It's best. You know, it really is for the best. Thanks for letting Jimmy spend the night, Beth. I hate leaving him alone when I'm gone. It's no problem. Mom, why can't I go with you? Jimmy, I have to take care of business. Yeah, but maybe I can help you. We could use your help right here, Jimmy. You could make up new slogans for the protest signs. Yeah. Sure. I hate deceiving him. Nancy, you know it's for the best. Hey, look who's back. Please, please, there's no need. There's no need. Did those creeps hurt you? Hurt me? Webcare doesn't hurt people. Oh. They help. No, 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 please, please listen to me. I, I was wrong to oppose Webcare. Oh. It does so much good. We should all be grateful. What did they do to you? They explained some things. They, they showed me the truth. Nancy, we were wrong. Webcare really does benefit us all. You know, I don't know what's going on here, but I intend to find out. Look, I have to go. Look after him until I get back, and then we'll get to the bottom of this. Father, can you remember anything about what happened to you? Huh? Nothing happened. I was in the room, in the chair, and they showed me the truth. I, I was wrong to say all those things about webcam. Webcam is good. <laughs> in the mod squad. Today's production for you. Hey, hey, talk to it, sister. Get on the line. Come on, move it. Hustle, hustle. Hey, We got thousands of kids screaming for this junk. This ain't webcam. You're working for a living now. Go, go, go. Take the side end. This is a raid! 
running in no time. I only want one of your wage hogs. I can't make a lousy buck anymore. What is this? Nancy Murphy, you are charged with violating provision 22. It is my duty to take you into custody. Gadget, you have a call on line two. Hi, Jimmy. Shh. Are you serious about being friends with Robocop? Oh, yeah. We're like that. Okay, good. My mom's in trouble and she needs help fast. Where are you? And I want you to know that despite being a criminal, Mrs. Murphy will receive the best of care. It was for poor, misguided individuals such as herself that I designed WebCare's state-of-the-art rehab program. I'm not a criminal. Provision 22 is the real crime. It is the law, Mrs. Murphy. No. Oh, we'll Murphy. fight it. Get that. Provision 22 is a lie, a cheat. It's designed to stop people from working. It's the truth. Listen to her. Jimmy, what are you doing here? Quit squirming, you little monster. <laughs> Now you guys are going to get it. Pick on someone your own size, creep. Kick his butt, Robo. Put that man down. He's a duly deputized employee of OCP. This woman has been charged with violating provision 22 of the Michigan Criminal Code, which gives us the authority to take her into custody. You can't let them do this. I must uphold the law. Take her away. I hate the law, and I hate you. Why don't you just go in there and get Nancy out? She has violated Provision 22. Have you read it? You can't work if you receive benefits, which are never enough to live on, so you get poor while OCP and WebCare get richer. It's inhuman. I must uphold the law. No, that's the machine talking. Alex Murphy wants to save his wife. I cannot violate my program. Well? If slugs like Martin can twist the law around and use it to their advantage, so can you. What can you tell me about WebCare's rehab program? I'll scan Metronet. Get a trespasser. Madigan? The suits at OCP are on my back, screaming for answers about the webcare bomb. I'm on it, Sarge. Okay, 
Harvin Forensics says the bomb was set off by a narrow beam microwave mini fuse, accurate up to 100 yards. So whoever it is, is a serious blast bug. That doesn't sound like Mark's people. No, and with the transmission being that tight, the creep had to be close by, maybe even in the crowd. So I programmed a simulation of the WebCare building against a pictal radial scan to find the most likely points of origin. You know, you're getting pretty good at this. All part of the job, sir. And I downlink Media Break's vid file of the protest, so let's try 99.8%. Beauty. Okay, so let's enhance. Got him. We won this guy's mug on Satnet, I guarantee you. He comes back with an arson and explosive record as long as your arm. Okay, I'll run him for ID and prior as you check out the mission. I'm already gone. Even longer than mine. Sergeant, did WebCare file an ITA for the arrest of Nancy Murphy? An ITA? Subclause 4891, provision 22. Requires WebCare to file an intent to arrest with the district attorney before apprehending a violator. Subclause 4891, huh? Where'd you come up with that one? A good cop knows the law. Hold on, I'm checking. Jimmy! Mom, are you okay? Oh my God. Well, it seems rebellion runs in the family. It's so sad. An innocent mind bent and twisted so early in life by an unstable parent. I don't care what happens to me, but please don't hurt Jimmy. <laughs> Webcare doesn't hurt. We help. But you and your son suffer this delusion that we're evil. Well, we're just going to help you understand that we're not. Take them to rehab. I checked twice. There was no ITA filed by WebCare for Nancy Murphy. Thank you, Sergeant. I'll keep scanning WebCare data, see what I can find out. Thank you, Diana. I must go now. My family needs me. Are we feeling today? Where is rehab? That's a restricted area. You are illegally holding Nancy Murphy. Where is she? Why should I tell you? Because I'm a cop. That's why.
they expect me to get anything done under these conditions? Robocop. It's gotta be. <sighs> Robocop! <gasps> Just relax, it will all be over soon. You will feel much better. People are sick and they need help. They are not leaving here. You wouldn't hit a woman. I would. <laughs> no! It's over now. You're safe. They can't hurt you anymore. Oh Look at what they did to him. And you expect us to help you? Listen, I'm on your side. I think this whole web care bombing was set up to make you guys look bad. Mm. And whoever it was probably had inside help. This is who I'm looking for. What's well, Harry? Harry? Harry Flitch. Do you know him? He helps out around here. Where can I find him? Do you know? He's out running some errands in the van. He should be back soon. Wait. I'll be right back. Hello? Beth, it's me. Nance, thank God. We were worried sick about you. And Jimmy, he's... Jimmy's with me. He's fine. Now listen, Beth, I want you to organize a press conference. It's urgent. Damn it, Jen. I just learned about a press conference being called at Father Mark Street Mission. What are these allegations about web care? Bombs, shooting, abducting people and brainwashing them? That's not OCP policy. Mr. Chairman, this is a vile, blatant attempt to slander WebCare. Well, just remember how much OCP has invested in this WebCare pilot program of yours. If it succeeds in old Detroit, we plan to privatize welfare throughout the country. We can't afford bad publicity. You have my word, sir. I'll take care of the situation. See that you do. Get me a coffee. Why don't you get it yourself? I wish you wouldn't do that. Lewis is lying. She's a greedy, cold, sadistic worm. Come now, she went to Harvard. The woman's a Milken scholar. Why do I keep telling myself there's actually a human being under that three-piece suit? Because it's true. I hope. I just cracked the security codes on WebCare's computer data. They keep people from working. They deny them their unemployment benefits and pensions, anything to get them on WebCare. Then it's rigged so that once you're in the system, you're trapped for life. Those are serious allegations. WebCare is making thousands of people suffer so OCP can make a profit. Minus what Lewis is skimming off the top for her private bank account. Take a look at the financial data yourself. The real data. All right, I will. If what you say is true, Lewis and Martin have a lot to answer for. Maybe there's hope for you yet. Get the coffee. Get an audit team in here with the financial data on web care. The real data. Damn it, I really wanted a coffee. Oh, I just picked up the equipment from Omni Mining Tech, Mr. Martin. Good. Ms. Lewis wants the bomb to go off during the press conference. Oh, don't worry. He'll make the six o'clock news.
Robocop kicked butt and my mom punched out a doctor. Listen, we'll talk about that later, okay? Now, we've got a press conference to get ready for. Everybody, we've got a lot to do. Beth, we've got to get together everything from Father Mark's file on webcam. This could be our last chance to expose the truth. Hey, why don't you stay for the press conference? Come on, you're the one that made this possible. No. My job is done. Murphy, come on, you're your family. I must go. Somewhere there's a crime happening. This won't take long. Mr. Chairman, this is a welcome surprise. Don't be so sure. I had an audit team go over your financial data, the real data. I know about the pension benefits you've stolen from people to make them go on web care, and the funds you've diverted to your personal bank account. You've been diverting <laughs> funds? There must be some mistake. Yes. And now I have to correct it. I'm on my way to that press conference to personally apologize for your actions. You're going to the mission. Sir, why don't you come to my office and we'll talk? I don't have time for meetings with ex-employees. Ex? Your termination papers have been signed and your bank account seized. Damn it, I have made millions for OCP. You can't do this to me, old man. Look on the bright side. I'm sure you will qualify for welfare. You've been embezzling money and you didn't let me in on it. Oh, we'll talk about this later, Martin. Well, what later? The chairman's gonna have you put away for this. Hardly. He's on the way to the mission. He should be there just in time for Flitch to set off his noisemaker. The old relic will be dust. Hey! Oh, <laughs> oh you're awake! <laughs> well, good. I don't want you to miss the big finale. <laughs> See, this is a Zambrium charge. It's compliments of OCP. They use it in mining in uh, Siberia. It'll blow this whole place, whole building, into a into a crater. <laughs> oh, but here's the pretty part: magnetic resonance projector. <laughs> it's another mining tool. See, it takes a subterranean sonic readings. Only I modified it to create a massive sonic pulse. <laughs> tuned to a frequency that resonates inside the human cranial cavity. <laughs> it uh, scrambles the gray matter like a kitchen blender. <laughs> you see, if it doesn't blow everybody up, it'll blow their minds and everybody else for blocks. <laughs> now, you see, anybody not wearing one of these gets turned into a permanent drooler. Webcare gets rid of the malcontents and makes a bunch of new clients. <laughs> well, I'll see ya. <laughs> Have a blast, baby. <laughs>
a trouble officer. I hope not. It may interest you to know I'm shutting down the web care pilot program. I had no idea what was going on until our friend Diana enlightened me. Smart lady. I don't understand how well-bred, educated employees like Lewis and Martin could become so misguided. I must have a talk with personnel. But for now, I have to mend some fences and eat a little crow. It's not easy being human. And we demand that the police conduct a full investigation of WebCare's criminal activities. That won't be necessary. Hold on, everybody. Let's just hear him out. I want you to know that OCP was not aware of the improprieties of WebCare's management staff. Oh, come on. You expect us to trust you? You tried to fry our brains. That was somebody else, son, and she's no longer with the company. Come in. The tracking board shows Madigan still at the street mission, but she won't answer her radio. She went to check out a guy named Harry Flitch. He's a pyro freak out of Philly. Real sicko. The kind of guy who enjoys his work. After all, where would we be without you? MR projector. If the pulse wave goes off... I know. Can you defuse it? No. Evacuate the building.
much for the confession, Flitch. Oscillation feedback that I generated to contain the sonic pulse. Like a wall of sound. Cool. Your caller, Madigan. My pleasure. Hey, now, I, I was only taking orders. Those two clowns at WebCare, they cooked this whole thing up. Detective, I want Lewis and Martin arrested immediately. Oh, yes, sir. Father Marks will get the best treatment available at the Omni Mediplex. You and I have got some talking to do, young lady. So long as we do more than talk. Great. Thank you again. You all seem to be there when we need you. It's my job, ma'am. I'm a cop. Thanks. <laughs> 